people feel the coexistence of nature mm. doing the ikebana. Yes. Oh, oh okay. cutting off. Some then the line matches. becomes clear. Oh uh, yeah, because that's symmetrical. Yeah. So exactly, exactly. To just exactly. change a little bit. And welcome to Let's Ask Shogo. It's me, Shogo, and I have Kazu. Hi. And also Tomoko. Hello. All right. So today, everyone, we're going to be taking you here to Waku Japan, where you get to experience various traditional Japanese culture. And today, we're going to be doing the Kado, Kado. flower arrangements. In this channel, we'll be introducing hidden gems in Kyoto. So if you're a Kyoto lover planning to come to Kyoto someday, be sure to subscribe to enjoy more content. Let's go inside. Let's go inside. At WAC Japan, you can experience various Japanese traditional cultures and a 100-year-old Kyoto-style buildings and Japanese households. You can also enjoy special activities at famous shrines and temples that are usually not open for viewing. Today, we will be experiencing Kado. Kado is said to have begun in the 6th century when Buddhism was brought into Japan as a way to offer flowers to Buddha. And it developed greatly during the Muromachi period as a new style of architecture called Shoinskuri was born. Flowers were originally placed at the Tokonoma, which is a space in a tatami room to show valuable tableware and paintings in order to enhance the beauty of these works of art. Soon, these flowers began to be considered as pieces of art on its own, leading to kado becoming a do art. How are kado and flower arrangement different? Where should you look to enjoy kado flowers? Let's find out. Oh wow, it's so beautiful inside. Okay, I believe this is where we take off our shoes, but there's actually some space where they sell things, I believe. Oh, tea bowls, mm -hmm. mm -hmm. tea whisks, containers. Well, oh, and they have origami experiences too, so they have the origami here too. All right, so I believe it's this way, so I'd like to take off my shoes and oh. head inside. Seishimasu. Ah. <laughs> Not only can you choose popular experiences such as sado, kado, or shodo, you can also choose various activities like Japanese home cooking, playing the koto harp, sake tasting, kendo, etc. Today we had Ogawa-san, the managing director of Waku Japan, give a tour of the building to the room for our experience. She first showed us a tea room where tea ceremony experiences are held. What's interesting is that the windows in this room are at a low position, so that when you sit on the tatami mats, you can see the garden in the back of the room. Traditional Kyoto-style buildings usually have a garden in the center of the house. This is because in the past, taxes were decided depending on the width of the entrance, with the whole building being narrow at the entrance and getting wider as you go in. A garden was necessary in order to get sunlight in the house. Today's kado experience will take place in the room, which is a formal sake warehouse renovated into a large tea room further in the building. Hello, welcome to Waku Japan. I'm Emiko Ashida. I was born here in Kyoto, near Nijojo Castle. Oh. Today I'd like for you to enjoy Ikebana. Ikebana, yes. I think you know Ikebana is a traditional Japanese flower yes. arrangement. Mm -hmm. Japan has four clear cut seasons. Mm -hmm. It brings us a variety of flowers and grasses. Mm -hmm. People feel the coexistence of nature mm -hmm. doing the Ikebana. Yes. But meanwhile, these days, Western style one has become very popular, mm -hmm. especially among young women. Oh! <laughs> so when we say flower arrangement, mm -hmm. it usually means Western style one. Mm, yes. So when we That's want right. to mention about the traditional one, mm -hmm. usually use the word Ikebana. Okay, so there's so today, different so words. Yes, so mm -hmm. today I'm going to enjoy Ikebana, not the flower Okay, so thank you. <laughs> mm -hmm. The instructor taught us the difference between Ikebana and Western flower arrangement. Number one is whether the art has a front side or not. Ikebana is placed at the Tokonoma where the floor is slightly higher than the rest of the room and is surrounded on three sides. 
Therefore, it is decorated so it looks most beautiful from the front side. On the other hand, western flower arrangements are placed on a table, so it must look beautiful from all directions. Number two is whether you need to focus on lines and spaces. In Ikebana, lines and spaces are greatly valued. You need to cut the flowers and branches accordingly. In western flower arrangement, you fill the spaces with flowers. This is why Ikebana is called the art of subtraction, and flower arrangement is called the art of addition. Number three is asymmetry. In Ikebana, flowers are decorated asymmetrically, and imperfection is considered to be a type of beauty. Also, apart from flower arrangement, which uses flowers that are at their full bloom, Ikebana uses those that have not yet bloomed to express the flow of time. In today's experience, we'll use a shallow flower vase with a base called Kenzan placed in it. The Kenzan has many spikes, which makes it easy to stick the flowers and branches in it to support them. I'll show one arrangement, one example. Oh, yeah. Yeah. So the first you have to check which is the front, which is the back. back. Of course, front and back. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. First, I have to measure the size. Usually, the highest one, the diameters, mm -hmm. one and a half. Oh, one and a half. Or twice of the base diameter. Oh, okay. There are so many rules for everything. Mm. Okay. So it is easy to fix the thing. Oh, wow. And then the next one. I have two, so maybe this way. The first one and the second one, three quarter. As I said before, too much is not good. So maybe. This one is too much. Mm. Oh, oh. Okay, you're cutting off some then the line becomes clear. And mm. oh. This line is very beautiful. Maybe this is too much, I think. Mm. Then cut it. Oh, oh. So how is it? I have three flowers here. Gabela. Gabela, mm. Gabela, you know, I think you know, almost the same. Mm. I will use this one. If air enters the stem when it is cut, it becomes difficult for the flower to absorb water. Therefore, when you cut the stem, you must always do so under the water. You do not have to do so with branches, but because they are stiff, you need to cut them with an angle so it becomes easier to stick to the kenzan. After placing the first Garbella daisy up straight, the second one is cut shorter and faced a little to the front, with the third one positioned towards the back. Next, the Kinzan, which supports the flowers, showing is not graceful, so it needs to be hidden. To do so, carnations are cut shortly and decorated in the front with lemon leaves to the side. Finally, some more lemon leaves are added in the back to express depth of the art piece. Oh, wow. this is wow! Again, there's still a lot of space in between. Mm. Yeah, again, space is utilized, right? Let's start. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> so we first open. Yes, first is open. Yeah, a material is. Ajisai, sweet pea, and tulips. Oh, tulips, okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Wow. And for cherry blossoms, and for the aristomelia. Aristomelia. And the iris, this one. So, my flowers, mm -hmm. there's several branches here. Yep. The main one, anyway. Mm -hmm. Yes. Which one is the strongest? Please check. Oh, I see. Wait, this one is the strongest. Mm, it looks thick and. And this just measure the oh, size. Yes. So as mm. for this one, measure diameter and one. it's twice. Twice. Twice, like here. Oh, okay. So I need to cut it. Yes. Maybe like around here. Yes. Diagonally. Careful. Okay. Very <laughs> good. 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 You just place here and make a space. Then you can put other oh, another coordinate one. Oh, okay. And first we push it. Push it really okay. hard. Oh okay. Oh that's that's really yes. deep. <laughs> yes. And then if you want to make it bent, 
Almost tilt it. A yeah, tilt it a little bit. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. And the next one should be shorter. Oh, shorter, yes. Yeah. Shorter. Yeah. This just one is the highest one. Okay. So please go ahead. Okay, thank you. So yeah. you yeah. I'm going to go with this one. This is also the shape of the shape. Let's see. This is the top. 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 Oh, it looks really big. It's it very strong. <laughs> very hard. <laughs> then, uh, that branch is really big. It is really big. It's very hard. Mm. So then, uh, cut. Uh, cut. Half one first. more time. One 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 more time. <laughs> so this is the main one, and then maybe you can put this one. This is very straight one, so it should be longer. Please make this one at the bottom side, like this way. Major, but too high, so just like this one. Then. How long? Maybe here? Here. Yeah. Okay, then once cut here. Mm -hmm. And then check it. Mm -hmm. Okay. Very good. Nice, all three of the branches oh. are <laughs> good. Very good sense. Good, 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 good. Mm. Mm. The I, I'm gonna use yeah, these two tulips for the main in the center. Uh-huh. Mm. Which one is more beautiful? What do you think? Which one mm. is better? I actually like the one that you have in your right hand right now, actually. Yeah, yeah, okay. yeah. It's closed even more mm. than the left one. So, so. Uh, for the same flowers, please make the different height. Oh, okay. The, the height. same height is not so interesting. Oh, uh, yeah, because that's symmetrical. Yeah. So exactly, you exactly. To just exactly. change a little bit. That's right, that's right. Mm. 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 うん、それそこに置いたらいいと思う。そうそう。ここに水に触ってるのあんまり言うことないので、これは切ってしまいましょう。そしたらあともう一つでここの正面をところ埋めたら、はい。これちょっと短めにした方がいいと思う。そうね
Close you down the build excellent food. really <laughs> you have a sense of arrangement <laughs> <laughs> yeah. of course yeah. natural yeah. talent <laughs> yes did you enjoy it, it th i did yes yeah. it was really really fun thank mm -hmm. you so much <laughs> <laughs> So we just got out of Walk Japan and the Kado experience. It was really, really fun, definitely. Oh, I think it's the best part about it is that, especially like for me who have like, I don't know anything about art, right? But even if you don't have that much confidence, if you come here, the instructor, the sensei will teach you everything and you don't have to be afraid about it at all. So I think that would probably be the best part. Yeah, it'll be, at the end, it will be a beautiful piece of art because the instructor will help you out even if you don't, if you're not really a familiar with flower arrangements at all. How was it for you, Kazu? Well, you know, uh, in the past, we've posted uh, several videos mm -hmm. talking about kado and did, uh, flower did. arrangement. That's right. But uh, this is actually my first time uh, being taught directly from a sensei. Exactly. So uh, it was just amazing listening to every, like each technique, mm -hmm. the theories, and the way of thinking. Exactly. And, That's you know, right. because we got to uh, actually do the experience, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Um, you know, at first I was really nervous. Yeah. I, 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 I really so. didn't think that I would, like, get anything good <laughs> <laughs> but you know uh getting advice from the sensei mm -hmm. and looking at my uh piece mm -hmm. at the very end mm -hmm. it was really nice and yeah. I, I really think i did a pretty good job you did you did mm. seriously yeah that's right how uh, was it for you Tomoko? you have a little bit of experience in flower arrangements so mm, i believe I, you felt something different than us because flowers are familiar to us so experience kado is an easy way to learn mm. about Japanese culture. Mm, mm. Definitely, definitely, exactly. All right. So to everyone, if you're interested in coming here to Black Japan, please take a look at our description box because we have the link to their website. And our goal is to achieve 1 million subscribers by January 2023. So your help would mean a lot. And we'll see you in our next Kyoto Hidden Gems. Thank you so much. Bye -bye. The sun is literally in my face. <laughs> bye bye. bye, -bye. bye, -bye.